It starts with a scalpel and ends with a tube draining fluid from your brain. This is a life-saving procedure called a ventriculostomy, and it's not for the faint of heart. Step 1. The scalpel cuts through the skin at a spot called Kotcher's point of safe zone on the skull used in neurosurgery. Retractors pull the skin open, giving the surgeon a clear view of the skull. Now, the Midas Rex drill comes in. It bores a hole straight through the skull, yes, right into the bone. Underneath lies the dura mater, a tough protective membrane around the brain. Another scalpel cuts through the dura, revealing the soft tissue inside. Then comes the catheter. It's gently slid through the drilled hole into the ventricles of the brain to drain excess fluid. Ever seen a brain surgery up close like this? Tag someone who could handle this level of detail dot dot. Here's what most people don't know. The catheter stays in. The skull is closed using metal staples, securing the catheter and tubing outside the head.